Hey there, everybody. This is Super Snow. We're just hanging in the background of some Fallout Shelter. I'm playing on the glorious. Ah, shit. I can't say that. Oh, well. Anyways, guys, I've been watching a couple of videos. Uh, Metal Gear Solid 5 comes out at the end of this month, which is about eh, like 10 or 11 days from now. And already, I I'm seeing a, a huge wave of people just going out of their way to just farm the shit out of every little tiny detail that they can uh, out of this. I, I, out of the game, out of everything that comes out with it. Uh, this isn't something new, obviously. Uh, people have been doing this since, God, what, the beginning of time when it comes to making money off shit like this on YouTube. So it's not a big shocker that people would do this, but it's just, it's so pathetic. Like, I, I don't get that mentality. I mean, I get it. Everybody needs to make money in this world, okay? that that That's a given. But if you're willing to just lower yourself to that kind of low... You're just as bad as the people like in Grandpa and all them, you know? You're, you're just as bad as those guys. I, I remember when uh, GTA V was coming out. I mean, that, that was supposed to be one of the biggest games of all time, and it, you know, it rightly was. But just the amount of bullshit, the amount of just stupid bullshit I heard on a damn near daily basis from YouTube channels who I had respect for to, you know, to go out and farm every little story that they could out of this game and keep using the same repeating uh, trailer videos because that's all they had, you know, you didn't have any real gameplay over and over and over in every single video that shit gets stale, it gets boring, and it's just stupid. Half of the shit that these people hype up in these games either never happens or ends up being nowhere near what it was supposed to be. You want an example? I'll give you a couple examples. When GTA 5 was coming out, people were saying, Oh man, it seems like uh, you'll be able to uh, not be able to see when you're out in the country. It'll be so dark that you'll have to use flashlights in your car's, um, uh, your car's headlights to be able to see. It never happened. Dark Souls 2 comes out. You know, they're going to say, Oh yeah, the beta's going to be exactly like the real game. It changed and it never happened. Then Scholar of the First Sin came out. Those same people who hyped up Dark Souls 2 come out and be like, Well, enemies will now patrol. It never happened. Well, uh, there's a new sneak mechanic that you can sneak by most enemies. It never fucking happened. I mean, are you seeing a pattern from these guys? You know, they hype up all this stuff from these games. They you know, they take any little theory that they can and milk the shit out of it, or the game itself. Have you seen that guy called Smilk? He do I didn't even know about this. He's the guy who does, like, top ten things about Five Nights at Freddy's. There's only four games, and he has, like, what, over a couple hundred videos or something? He has a crap ton of them, and he keeps making them all the time. That's what I'm talking about, man. These people who literally just milk every little tiny thing that they can out of these series to make as much money as possible. That's fucking pathetic, man. You're trash. You're filth. You want to know what I do with trash? I throw trash away. That's where you belong. In the dump. But in all serious, though, it's just kind of pathetic to see people go out of their way to just milk every little, you know, penny that they can out of these games. And it's not surprising that the game industry does the same goddamn thing with its own games. Now you have YouTubers doing it, too. I'm glad I'm not a big YouTuber. Because people would pressure me to be like, Oh, dude, you gotta talk about this. Oh, dude, you gotta talk about that. And I get it, you know, that's part of the reason is because most of their subscribers are telling them, Man, why don't you do a story on Chico possibly being quiet? And, they, you know, they feel pressure to do so. But you should have some integrity and just be like, Dude, no, I'm not gonna milk this franchise. I've already made 15 videos on this game that isn't even out yet. Isn't that funny? That these fucks can make 25 to like 100 videos on a game that's not even out yet and talk about it like they know it even though they never went to any kind of E3 or they never played a demo or anything like that. Isn't that funny? Yeah, that's kind of funny to me. Anyways, guys, uh, this is Super Snow. Leave your thoughts in the comments. Me personally, I'm just tired of seeing this shit. I'm tired of people being little shits about this and and, and then you get the people who back it up because you know oh I like seeing the theory well that's great but you're also part of the problem anyways guys this is Super Snow leave your thoughts in the comments I'll see you guys later